can never ever find the right words And there's no way this is real life There's no telling you Guys, it's officially here, the 100k play button. This has been a long time dream of mine. I cannot wait to show you guys what's inside. So let's go ahead and crack this open before we get to the shop. So yes, guys, officially we've made it to 100k. This play button came in so quick. A lot of people said that the play button takes forever to get, but you guys know me, as soon as it hit 100k, I went to YouTube, I went ahead and sent them an email. I was like, yo, guys, how do I get this play button? So the play button is officially here. I can't wait to unbox it. The delivery guy said that when he got this in the delivery truck, he kept this next to him and he was literally making sure it doesn't get mixed up with anything else and then he hand delivered to my parents instead of just leaving it in the mailbox <laughs> And he was like, is this real? And, I, and my parents were like, yeah, this is real. And I just been waiting for it. I had the tracking and everything. It's gotten here. It actually said it was gonna get delivered tomorrow, but it got delivered today. So uh, let's just crack this sucker open. This is the first thing I've ever made myself. It's a little 5K dog tag. When we hit 5K subscribers. And then I made this 10K YouTube plaque pretty much from the garage. <laughs> so this is like my 10K YouTube plaque that obviously YouTube doesn't send you, but I, feel, I felt like 10K was something huge. And we did it, guys which is absolutely insane. Then now, the official YouTube black from YouTube, 100K. Let's go ahead and unbox it. Let's crack it open with the 5K uh, dog tag. You know, it'll be kind of cool. Okay, he's <laughs> so excited. Oh my God, okay, so this is the YouTube play button 2020, guys. So, um, okay. So it just says pretty much that you've just done something that very few YouTube creators accomplished. You had an astonishing 100,000 people subscribe to your channel. So thank you guys so much. So that is officially that. Let's go ahead and move that out of the way. <laughs> and then we've got a little card here. Congratulations on the subscriber milestones. You're honored to take a part of recognizing your achievements and want you experience to be exceptional. This award is in, inspected and packaged by Great Care by Rick. And here is the play button, guys. Hold up, hold up. Here it is. Oh my God. It's a lot lighter than I imagined. <laughs> but oh my God, guys. Nor Hamadi for passing 100K subscribers. That is insane. That is, that is beautiful. Oh my God, this is gonna be an absolute pain to hang, but well worth it. Oh my God, guys, thank y'all so much for this. Yes, and literally see my reflection. What's up, guys? So you guys saw it here. Thank y'all so much for surpassing 100K. If you guys wanna support your boy, I still have 100K pop sockets, 100K air fresheners, everything else 100K has been sold out. So if you guys wanna cop some of that, link down below. So thank y'all so much for that. I even put a bunch of them in my car, so if I'm running to you guys in person, or if you guys see me, come up to me. I'll give you guys some free pop sockets, some free air fresheners for the next month because I love y'all so much. And for those of you guys who are kind of on the further side, link down below. That doesn't mean come to my house. Please don't come to my house. <laughs> yeah. And Anywho, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and show this to my family. I'm gonna go ahead and show it to my fiance, and then I'm gonna go ahead and head out to the shop and figure out what's going on with the the 650. I kind of feel like it's just insane. It's a V8. My goal today is to get that car to turn over. Yes, we're gonna try to get that car to turn over. We're gonna detail. We're gonna make it look as good as possible. Get it to turn over. See if it'll drive. We already know the top goes down, so super excited for that. So let me just do my thing with my fam, and I'll head to the shop. the shop so what's up Jonathan what's up John <laughs> so we just made it to the shop here with the six series you guys know that uh, we got this in last night so uh, what I want to do today is get my friend Nick to figure out what's going on with the whole key situation yeah you guys heard me because basically when we ran the codes it said something about a key uh, not being programmed this does look like an aftermarket key it was half programmed so for those of you guys who know about coding it was coded to the cast but not coded to the DME. So that means the computer couldn't recognize it, so it won't crank over. So my friend Nick, he thinks he can go ahead and do it. So he's gonna go ahead and try to code this in for me. And that should get the car to turn over. If I don't see white smoke because of valve stem steel failure, then uh, I don't know, man. Uh, I, might, I might keep it and turn it. I might straight pipe it, make it a beast. I don't know, because my first V8, that cost me under $20,000. Because <laughs> my last V8 was like $20,000. So. That, was, that was more than 20000 it was a lot, it was like 27,000. So. You, you had a video on it. <laughs> things happen in life, you know? But uh, this thing's actually super nice, guys. For a convertible, this is probably my best convertible I've ever owned. All the other ones, the, the tops don't even work, actually. So, uh, anywho. Jonathan's here. Um, so what are you gonna be doing real quick? I'm gonna be detailing this car. Hey, <laughs> so you guys seen how, that's how it's hella dirty and stuff? So he's gonna go ahead and detail it, detail the interior so I can actually like enjoy 
the presence of this car. Record with this down. Isn't that so much easier? <laughs> it's actually so sick. And like Jonathan just like jammed in here James Bond style and got in. I don't know if I'm going to be doing that because I actually care about my interior. But um, I, I let him do it because it's already super dirty. It really doesn't matter. Uh, but yeah, I, we're going to have to get a new airbag. But obviously all this stuff is going to happen once I actually get the car started. So hopefully today's goal is to clean up this car and get it started. If you guys want to see the full detail of this car, it's going to be in Jonathan's channel. Link down below. So he's going to be much more detailing the whole car, making it look as mint as possible. All you guys are going to see in this video video is pretty much the finished product and uh, the coating so hopefully 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 guys this is it if not we're gonna go down to AutoZone a bunch of buy a whole bunch of parts spark plug ignition coils all that stuff to see if we can get this thing started today uh, but yeah hopefully it's just the coating thing let's just get to it So, moment of truth, uh, let's see if this thing actually turns on. Bro. So, oh, so it should be good then, right? I mean, I guess, <laughs> I guess. So he just went ahead and coated it. He coated it, he coated the cast, the DME, right? Okay, so, he, uh, he, something like that. <laughs> <laughs> so those two things are now coated, which means I'm pretty sure, hopefully, okay. the car should start. Ready? Yeah. Okay. No, Damn, it's dead, it's dead. dead <laughs> We wanna go ahead and get the 435 and jump it. So we'll see. I mean, I'm hoping the thing will turn over, but I don't know what's going on. This thing is not doing it for the car. So I know it's a V6 and normally you need a V8 to jump a V8, but let's just go ahead and figure it out. <sighs> Guys, let's see, let's see. Let's see. Moment of truth. Bro, <laughs> bro, it's good. It's good. What the, bro, the idol is perfect. Bro, it's on. Dude, that's crazy. <laughs> what the hell? Squealing sound from the front, but hey, look at that idol. That idol is solid. So, uh, let me go ahead and just take it on the, just take it out for a spin and see if everything is good. All right, guys, car is running. It's squealing pretty bad. Uh, I'm not really too sure what that is. Uh, let's go ahead and check the coolant. Oh, a little bit of smoke. It's been sitting for a it's, long Yeah, time. it's been sitting for like six Could months. So, we need to top it off. Yeah. All right, guys, it is smoking pretty bad. So, I'm hoping it's just a valve cover. We'll see. Um, let's just go ahead and just top it off with a little bit of coal. Take it on the block and just to see if it overheats or not. It is smoking pretty bad. I, I'm pretty sure it could just be a valve cover or it just could be all this excess oil that's just been on there or dirt. It's been sitting for five months. We're just going to let it be. Hopefully, the temperatures don't go up. Jonathan is checking the oil. Uh, all right, guys, it has some airbag lights, unfortunately, which we'll figure out. It could be the airbag module needs to be replaced, but... All right, engine oil level, guys. It says engine level oil. Okay, it's perfect. It says it's good. Yeah, let's go out for a spin real quick. All right. <laughs> oh, it's going in drive. <laughs> bro, what, <laughs> bro, what the heck is going on? What is life? <laughs> It's good? Yes. It's spinning out. It's condens out spin. There's condensation in there, which is healthy. Yeah. So it's like. Bro, let's go out. Let's go out. Oh my God. <laughs> All right, for some uh, V8 action. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what the heck, dude? It's not bad. It's honestly not bad at all. Dude, the word I dropped off. What the heck? I feel so. <laughs> I feel so baller in this $800 car. Oh my god. It is smoking pretty bad, guys. So I, I, I mean, it's smoking a little bit. I don't know if that's just because it's been sitting. Okay. I mean, okay. honestly, it's not that bad. Dude, it's actually really nice. Can I feel it? I barely just. Yeah. Hey, I mean, hey, hey. It was worth a try. It was worth a try. Yeah. Is it kind of like. Oh, look at that front and rear. Wow, CCC yeah. over here. I can get in the airbag. <laughs> what is going on? Oh, it's a bird. <laughs> oh my god. I know, I've never been. Dude, this looks so baller. It doesn't Dude, you feel be like you're sitting in like a, like a $50,000 car. <laughs> I mean, it's, bucks. <laughs> so, so, it was 75,000 MSRP when it first came out, dude. Is it actually 75,000? 75, 75, it's, it's a nice car. 
172,000 miles later, this thing's still driving. <laughs> Bro, I'm not used to this. Like, just like stuff flying in. <laughs> it's the so nature car. All the gears are good. So that's third, fourth, no slipping, fifth, no slipping, sixth, no slipping. All right, all gears are good. Temperatures, I'm gonna leave it running. I want to see yeah. where the smoke gets us, but uh, I'm gonna let it run outside the garage and just see if it's a valve cover. I'm gonna check the oil temperatures. I'm gonna check the engine oil level. Well, oil temperatures too, right? Yeah. But it hasn't overheated so far. So we're we gonna straight pipe it or what? Bro, oh, I thought that was the car. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna, honestly, guys, uh, let's. Uh, what should we get this video to? Hmm. Get this video to 2,500. 2,500. And I'm, I'm gonna skip the muffler, skip the resonator, go full straight. Full pipe. straight pipe. And full you're you're gonna pipe. do it because this isn't a daily car. Like, it you're is not my gonna daily. daily. I, I so just go full. I set. know he will because 2,500. He likes, won't do it for that because that's his daily. But he will do it for this car because he won't drive this every day. So I better hear it straight piped within. <laughs> uh, you guys better get this video 2,500 2, 2, likes. likes and I want to hear it straight piped. piped. Yeah. <laughs> so I think we should just start the detail. Yeah. Let's, let me finish the detail. I already started, but uh, we should send a video to Nick real quick because shout out to Nick. For real. For getting this car started. It all was because of this aftermarket key that Dude. wasn't coded. He coded it to oh. the car. That's so crazy. That's so solid. The, the guys previously before us thought the car was messed up because the car won't start. But it was all because of the, what's it the called? Key. The key. Which is insane. Like they got a key, they got a program, but the guy didn't program it right. So they thought the engine was still messed up. So Dude. that's what happens when you guys don't get, get the right coder. Make sure you so guys. Again, uh... Shout out to Nick. Oh, dang, dude. This looks sick. Just, dude, what the heck? You know what also, guys. Make sure you get the, the hashtag save a BMW pop sockets. I, dude, they're actually so great. Okay, um, yeah. <laughs> it sounds really good. <laughs> oh, dang, dude. <laughs> wow. <laughs> ultimate flex right here. <laughs> oh my goodness. The top is mint. Dude, it actually looks really good. I don't like it like this though, to be honest. Huh? I don't like it like this. We need a, uh, we need it to be convertible. We'll go, we'll go back to convertible then. That's, that's not a problem. <laughs> not, a problem. <laughs> not a problem. This is so funny. <laughs> I've never had a convertible, so I've never. <laughs> oh, for, for the price? For the price, you honestly, be... you can't beat it. Oh shit. What happened? Oil temps? No. Nah. Oh, flick. All right, let me sit back in. All right. Hey, how's it smoking? Is it still smoking? Really? Bad. I didn't see it. I think it was just dirty, to be honest. It could just be really dirty, yeah. We're gonna keep driving a little more. Uh, temperatures look really good. Dude, it's a V8, what? <laughs> V8 Burt, six series, things got all the options. Bruh. Oh, I'm balling out, my J, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> Bro, it's solid. <laughs> huh? Try to do a burnout, seriously, here, is it, is it, uh, traction control's off already. I already have it off. Bro. <laughs> one, one tire fire, bro. Yeah. How do you feel about that? Dude, I don't even give a shit. <laughs> this car is running. Hey, you got an Oxcord. <laughs> Wait, what is that? No, oh, it is an Oxcord. You got an Oxcord. Hey, worth it. 800 bucks, <laughs> worth it. <laughs> it's worth every penny, worth bro. Every penny. Dude, this thing's mint. It actually is pretty nice. Okay, well, it, honestly, I'm happy with it. Like, yeah. shoot, the glove box just opened. Oh, we got heated seats, bro. Does it actually work though? Bro, we got heat, we got heated steering. We got heated steering. Dude. Is this cold? Is this a cold weather bro. package with a convertible? What bro, is this? Check out, what is check out the steering right here, dude. Okay, my question is, why on earth would you get cold weather package on a convertible? <laughs> dude, so I don't care. No, bro, it's heated. You see, like heated yeah, steering. Heat, because, like, you know, it's going to be cold. You got the uh, wind hitting you. But then what? Oh, you need the okay. heated steering. I guess. You need I the guess. heated, you know. I guess. You got I mean, all the luxuries. Kind of <laughs> all the luxuries. Oh, I felt that. Jeez. It's pretty solid. These seats are kind of comfortable. I'm not going to lie either. You feel heated? You feel heated? Oh, I do. It's live, bro. Oh, damn, this shit's hot. <laughs> For real. <laughs> my butt's burning. Dude, I feel like a baller. Like, straight up. Like, I'm a I straight baller. Other than my windshield cracked and my whole front end on the ground. <laughs> I, and my, my mirror missing. You know? It's pretty I, solid. I think I look like a baller. You know? And it needs an exhaust. It needs honestly. an exhaust. It's so quiet. I will do a muffler delete if straight, this video. Straight pipe. A muffler delete uh -huh. if this video gets to 1,500 likes. And I will go full straight pipe if this video gets to 2,500 likes. So, guys, it's smash that like button. I want to hear this thing straight piped. Like, I want right to hear now. it too, but you got, you guys got to, you guys got to tell me. You know, like, <laughs> oh my lord. We just got this engine oil level too high, so we're gonna have to drain some oil today. So I think that's what we're gonna do. Uh, I think they kept up putting more oil because it wasn't starting. Yeah, probably. So uh, let's just join like a whole quart or something and see if this will go a little bit lower, or maybe even two quarts. We'll see. So this is how it looks before. Um, Jonathan, are you able to clean off that airbag blown that, you know, just like touch yeah, that up I a little bit? Yeah, right? Like just a little bit of uh, cleaning up should fix that. 
But uh, other than that, you guys will see the before and after. So here's the before. I mean, the after should be a tremendous difference. And then the exterior, we'll have to get that out, right? Put up the top and everything. So uh, meantime, uh, this is the before and here's the after. All right, guys, and a little update with Johnny over here. Uh, what are you doing? I'm disinfecting the steering wheel. So you're keeping this car? Coronavirus free. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. So the car's looking a lot better. That string there was is there, and I honestly can disconnect it now, but I'm gonna leave it there just until I get the key actually cut it out because the key actually only functions, the key only works electronically. The manual key, it, it doesn't work. It's not even engraved. So I can't pop the trunk if the battery's dead. So I'm just gonna keep that orange thing there just until I get that key engraved basically. But yeah, he pretty much detailed most of the interior. He still has to do that little polishing thing, but it's coming together, guys. It's looking so good. I'm gonna go ahead and remove that airbag so it stops looking like an absolute massacre in here. Um, and this windshield, I'm gonna have to get replaced ASAP. So you guys guess it, we're gonna go ahead and remove the airbag real quick, just so the interior will look a whole lot better. I went ahead and already ordered an airbag, so let's just get that one out, because it just looks so terrible. All right, and that's it. Right. <laughs> so, All right, nice. Looks a, dude, 10 times better. At least I can move my hand, you know? Like, this thing is terrible. Yeah, let's go ahead and take a picture of this, and we'll go ahead and order a new one. This is how the car is currently sitting. You guys already know it has all the front end damage, but it's also a complete filthy mess. Jonathan went ahead and detailed the interior, so shout out to him for that. We're gonna go ahead and de just detail the exterior as well, make it look as good as possible. So when we start piecing it together, it, li it literally feels like a nice car, because as you know, right now, it doesn't, doesn't feel too nice, but uh, hopefully by the end of this car wash, it should look pretty minty, if you ask me. Guys, I'm officially home right now. I did not, I was not able to record it. Jonathan actually got my reaction to the car wash and the detail and everything on his channel. So again, check him out down below. Shout out to him. And if you guys wanna see the 650i fully striped pipe, make sure to get this video to, six, to 2,500 likes, and I'll make sure to do that. I was literally gut the whole thing go full straight pipe and send it on this build. I really have big plans for this thing. I've never had a V8 that I kind of want to just go all out in, but it's it's really interesting how much I'm enjoying this build. I hope you guys are too. Uh, but yeah, without further ado, uh, here's the new outro. Hope you guys enjoy it.